Hello everyone, welcome to another tutorial video. Today I'm gonna to be showing you how you can sync your Outlook calendar to your Google calendar. So uh, let's say your work requires you to use Outlook but you prefer the Google side of things, you can sync the two. That way you can look at your Google and have everything coming from Outlook over to your Google calendar. The easiest way of doing this is doing this on a browser or, or online. So go to outlook.live.com and log in to your Outlook account. As you can see here, uh, I have my Outlook email pulled up here. And then what you want to do is in the upper right hand corner, you will see a gear icon. That is the settings. Click on that. And then at the very bottom, you'll see something that says view all Outlook settings. Go ahead and click on view all Outlook settings and this will pop up. Click on calendar, which is the third one down. And then here under publish a calendar, which will be the second option, select the drop down menu, go ahead and select the calendar that you want to share. And then you'll see two different permissions. It says can view when I'm busy, can view all details. If you want to share it completely uh, to edit and all of the things that I think you want to do, select can view all details, which is the second option, and then click the blue publish button right next to it. You'll see a bunch of different uh, letters and numbers here. The one you want says ICS. So what you want to do is click on the ICS link here and then go to copy link and then that will go ahead and copy all of that to your clipboard. Now hop on over to Google Calendar and then under Google Calendar here you'll see all of your shared and current calendars here. Select the addition symbol here next to other calendars that says add other calendars and then do from URL. So select the from URL option and then go ahead and paste that information from Outlook into the URL of calendar box here. And then if you want to make this calendar publicly accessible for your staff or other employees. You can do that like you normally would with an Outlook by checking that box there. And then click the blue button that says add calendar. Once you've done that, it'll load and it'll say calendar added. And then if we go back from our settings here on Google Calendar, you can see it now has that big long text string from Outlook. And then what you'll want to do to rename a calendar if the text from that calendar is too long is go to where that calendar is, go to the three vertical dots here, and then go to settings on that specific calendar. And then you'll have the name come up at the very top. And then you can just rename that calendar to say Outlook or something similar so you know that is your Outlook calendar synced with your Google calendar. And then once you're done, that should auto save. And as you can see, I now have an Outlook calendar being synced up with my Google Calendar. Thank you guys, as always, for watching. If this tutorial helped you out, please help me out by liking, sharing, and subscribing for more great guides just like this. And I will see you guys in the next video.